child who has had a stroke may have difficulty moving, but the amount of difficulty can vary. Children who have had a stroke can also have difficulty thinking. The location and size of the stroke can help the doctor know what to expect. However, children do not always show the kind of problems that we would expect based on what their brain looks like. Unlike older children and adults who have had a stroke, younger children are less likely to show the typical pattern of deficits and their impairments may be more widespread. For example, childhood stroke survivors often have difficulty moving or paying attention regardless of where their stroke happens in the brain. Childhood stroke survivors may have difficulty with speaking or understanding words, understanding things that they see, remembering, mood swings, or a combination of symptoms. Depending how old the child is and how severe the stroke is, the child may have problems immediately. Some of the symptoms may not be as bad in the months after the stroke. However, some stroke-related problems in children may not become obvious for several years. For example, speech delays will not be obvious in babies until developmental milestones are missed. Also, some children may not show problems with movement until they begin learning to write. Difficulty organizing thoughts and solving problems may not be seen until a child gets older. Understanding the specific type of thinking problems that a childhood stroke survivor is having helps everyone, including parents and teachers, develop the best plan for helping a child overcome his or her challenges.